Hello and welcome to Tabletop Odyssey. My name is Jay and today there have been some leaks for Star Wars Legion, the future announcements, which sort of makes sense and I think is probably true. Uh, but if at the end of this video you like this video, press the like and if you're not subscribed to the channel and you're interested in Star Wars Legion, please do so. It really does help. Massive caveat, massive amounts of salt. When it comes to leaks, they may not be true. However, I'm not sure I've ever spoke about a leak that has ultimately never materialised. So I'm betting on it, but take that what you will, it might still not be true. I just think that with the, what seems to be from FFG, there seems to be a, a delay in the announcements. I think this is likely true. So let's talk about what they actually are before I dawdle too much. Those leaks are, some of them are a bit more obvious than others. Padme, Cad Bane, by the way, Cad Bane, <laughs> Cad Bane. And uh, Clan Ren, Inferno Squad, Arc Troopers, uh, an ATRT for the Republic, the BX series droid commandos, and the Stap Riders. So, we will not dwell on Padme. Commander, operative, don't really care. Padme is a good shoe in. The, my, the only caveat to this is where's Anakin? Where's Anakin, bro? I need me some Anakin, though. Uh, rhymed, I didn't mean it. Uh, Cad Bane, I'm not, gonna, I'm not going to try and do his voice. That was much better than I anticipated. I'm I'm proud of that. <laughs> I mean, it was terrible, but I'm proud of it. Cad Bane, epic. I've been watching The Clone Wars, although I'm waiting now for Disney so I can actually watch it, like, all of it. Cad Bane, love him. Very excited about Cad Bane. Some of these I had to Google. Clan Men being one of them. I was like, oh, I don't even know what that is. So I'm not, maybe it's in Clone Wars, but I'm not up to it yet. Um, essentially, this is a group of Mandalorians, I think. Um, maybe a clan of them. So they'll be like a jumpy jumpy unit with jetpacks and stuff like that. Epic. <laughs> that sounds amazing. So that's fine. Uh, Inferno Squad are the ones... Oh, I've not done this very well, but you can see it anyway, whatever. This is basically, you know, the ones from Battlefront 2, I think. The ones with uh, Aiden. So yeah, cool. Uh, how they'll play... Uh, Cad Bane almost certainly is an operative, by the way. Padme might be an operative just to shoe in with that, who knows. Uh, Clan Ren has said probably a special forces jumpy jumpy unit, and these guys will be a, maybe like a an infiltrators, but for the Imperials. Yeah, excitable. Ex exciting and excitable is I. Um, so they all make sense. The Arc Troopers, I did predict the Arc Troopers ages ago as the special forces for the... Um, Republic and I think this is sort of making sense. So what's going to happen is Clan Ren and the Inferno Squad are sort of going to be a new style special operatives uh, Special forces unit not special operatives. Well, I guess special ops makes sense And I think the Arc Troopers and the BX series droids. So these are the Arc Troopers, which are basically special fancy, you know um, Republic clone troopers and then the BX series droids. They're the ones that could have like I'm not sure. I, I, there are special sniper droids, so maybe these aren't. Uh, but I think you might see these be a little bit more akin to, um, you know, the saboteurs and that kind of stuff. I could be completely wrong, and they might just all be the new style of operatives, uh, special forces, but we'll see. And uh, yeah, the Republic ATRT, that's in the Clone Wars at least. Uh, generally, it's painted, I think, like white or what have you, but ATRT is just a, a way of getting the Republic a bit of more variety little bit weird to have crossover that early. I think maybe you might have wanted, like, is it not something else they could have done? Um, and the Stap Riders, for those of you who are like me and sometimes have to Google stuff, I did actually know what these were for a change. My Star Wars knowledge, not too terrible. Um, these would be the droids riding these little bikes. Cool. I, I mean, like, yeah, fantastic. You're picking all the right things. I, you know, eventually I'd like, you know, Buddy Jar Jar Binks and all that kind of stuff, but I think you've got to go with the staples first. So, um, everything here for me is incredibly believable. Padme, yes. Cad Bane, if I was wishlisting, damn right Cad Bane would be on that list. So, uh, But I think like there's a chance and I hope it's true. Uh, Clan Ren, didn't really know too much about that. But if you're going to have like Inferno Squad, maybe it makes sense. I'm not 100% sure. But definitely the Separatists and the Republic needed some special forces in, in, in our lives. And they are two good shouts. They make perfect sense. So I couldn't complain about that. The Stat Riders, again, another shoe in, I think. And the ATRT. Yeah, there's not. There's lots of stuff out there, but if you're looking for staples of stuff, that's right up there. Now, yes, there's loads of things missing here. Anakin is my big. Like, I, ex I need classics, but, you know, we only got R2D2 and C3PO late in the day. Like, they're only just coming out, and the game's been out nearly two years. So. 
Um, I'm not surprised that we're not getting the classic Anakin, but it would just sort of make sense to have like him and Obi Wan, wouldn't it? But so I do think this list is probably true. The apparently it's coming from Asmodi and um, and the fact that they have now doing the thing where actually they've said we're going to try. Well, it seems to be that we're going to try and have the announcements closer to the actual thing. Which even if it gets leaked, it does mean and maybe you're not in favour of this or you are in favour of this that the people can't play it on like tabletop simulator and that kind of stuff. So it might even feel a bit fresher just trying, even if they don't succeed because things get leaked. Um, but if you are going to it, decrease that window, then there's more and more chances that it'll get leaked by Asmodi France or Asmodi Spain or somebody spotted it in a warehouse in China or whatever the whatever the, the way they come up, um, or they just putting on put it on the systems that their computers uh, shops can buy them. You know, all all kinds of where these things have come out. It would be nice to see them sort of tighten that down. But then again, I don't get to make these videos, so. I'm personally going to stick and say that this list I think is true. Um, I put my name on it, but that doesn't mean anything. I said I've not been wrong yet, but I could very easily still be wrong. Uh, Padme. You know, I'm not thrilled by Padme, but the fact that it's uh, it would be a female is good news because the variety, I think, in um, Star Wars Legion is, can be pretty bad, I think. But any time that happens, I'm pretty happy with that. She's maybe not the most thrilling of characters, but... Whatevs. Cad Bane, Cad Bane is like, oh, oh, <laughs> Cad Bane. Um, and then the rest, I think, are just sort of like obvious ish shouts. I didn't know what Clan Men was, but apart from them, the rest, I think, is predict like predictable. I think I might have even predicted it when I was predicting what was coming in Clone Wars. So um, I do think it's predictable. I do think it's likely true. And it's very exciting. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. But yeah. Um, it's a shame to talk about, like, it's a shame that they get announced or leaked like this. I would prefer official FFG articles, of course, but it would be remiss of me. <laughs> Popping out the fancy words. It would be remiss of me. It would be bad of me to not talk about them. So there you have it. I'm in a weird mood. Have a most beautiful day. Like and subscribe. Goodbye.